Tenkichi 30, hope everyone's having a great day. Welcome to the Hong Kong Massacre. It's a top-down shooter. I know some of you guys don't really like top-down stuff, but if you like John Woo slow motion, just shoot everybody stuff, then I feel like this game could be for you. So, anyway, probably a single episode, so let's go. Still drinking old fashioned? Here you go for old time sakes. So the time has finally come. Got all the information that you wanted about the two headed dragon. I think you should start with returning to the tea house. I wish you good luck. Or am I? Upgrade weapon. Okay, that, that, that was just a little weird. Just cutscene after cutscene and loading screen after loading screen. Can we... I, I, don't, I can't upgrade with anything right now, so we're just gonna select the pistol. Use L to move, R to aim. Slow motion is LT. Okay. How do I get that back? Oh, there's my meter. I see. Oh, Jesus Christ. Alright, got him. Wow, that was a lot of blood. Feels pretty cool so far, actually. It doesn't feel like... Where is this guy going? There seems to be some weight to it. That is a window, I think. Wow. But yeah, it's like a top-down Max Payne. Wow, that is a ton of blood. It's like a, it's like a, like a jam jar exploded. Continue. That was pretty fun. It's levels so far are kind of bite-sized. Yeah, I think he's out for revenge. That took me... wait, what? Challenges. Second level. Death comes knocking at the door. So let's start the level. Best time, no record. I got one. I can upgrade nothing. <laughs> one star. I have to do better. Okay, is that a window? No, it's not. Oh, I missed. First shot I missed. I don't know where this person is, but I'm gonna slow motion. Oh wait, there's a door. Okay. E. All right. Gonna have to take cover. Wow, that guy is just. What kind of door is that? It's a saloon door, I think. Oh, wait till he gets up. Oh! Wow! Wow! Did you see the spread on that shotgun? I just. Ran into that in slow motion. 
If you're wondering, I am using a controller. Whoa, boy! That's a window? Okay. I'm glad that the, uh, the slow-mo meter is actually, it fills up pretty fast. Okay, that is definitely a window. I wasn't sure. Okay, I got you this time. Can I pick that up? Oh. oh. <laughs> yes, I can. Hi. Sometimes it's hard to tell doors from windows. Uh, let's see. Ooh, let's line them up. Damn, I got both of them? That was dope. Oh, shoot. <laughs> wow, how, wow, wow, wow. How do I, how do I do that flip? How do I do that flip? I don't know the flip button. X, B, R, T. Okay, I'm a little scared right now. Maybe I don't, I don't have the flip yet. I don't even know how I survived that other one. I'm just aiming at the, at the arrow. Man. It's like super blurred out here, but, uh, pretty sure you can tell they're dead. That was not bad. Okay, I'm going to, this is a taste of it. I don't want to play for too long. I actually want to play Monster Hunter right now. So that's what I've been doing, if you guys have been wondering where I've been. I know I still have to finish a lot of stuff. There's some projects that I have to actually finish, hopefully, before the end of January. First interrogation with the suspect regarding the events that took place between June 10th and June 13th. Police officer. Present at the interrogation of police officer Si Wong Lo and the suspect. Interrogation starts at 1545. The date is June 14, 1992. So let us start at the beginning. We know that you came back to Hong Kong on June 10th, arriving at 1715 with flight 1435 from Bolivia. I am now showing suspect surveillance footage from the airport. We know that you arrived at Lu Cheng's restaurant at 2005, and then made a visit to Tea House. To Tea House, killing some... Wait, what? Killing some... Wei's Chow goons? Then at 2100, you knocked at the door at one of Wei's Chow's apartments, down in Fuchiang Estate, used for drug distribution, turning into a bloodbath. So now let us talk about the events that took place after the apartment on June 10th. Wow, look, the dialogue flows smoothly in this game. Four days earlier. Level unlocked. I haven't even done a flip yet. I don't know the buttons, but I think I'm going to end it there. Little taste of the Hong Kong Massacre. It's pretty stylish so far. Um, I don't know how much variety it's going to have later on. Uh, yeah, except for probably the guns you'll be using. Maybe tougher enemies. I don't know. But uh, so far, the look is cool. Like the music and whatever it's doing to feel like a John Woo game slash, you know, like uh, Max Payne top-down. It's doing that right. So hopefully it can keep it up. I think the game's like three to four hours long, so we'll see. Anyway, that's going to be it for this single episode of the Hong Kong Massacre. So if y'all made it this far, thanks for watching. As always, take care and take it to 30 out. Alright, y'all. See you later, everybody. And please, keep smiling.